welcome to EffectsPortal.net. Today I'll be showing you how to make an RGB split in After Effects without using any plugins, just using uh, layers and compositions. So let's see what we're going to create. Let's show you here. And you can just see halfway through the video, there's a little shake there. We're showing revealing red and blue. That's what we're going to create. The first thing we're going to do in After Effects is create a new composition. I'm doing one HD square pixels at 100 frames. Click OK. I'm just going to import our file, open, and then drag it in to the composition, and then scale it down. And this happens to be an image that I took when I was in London, which is of HMS Belfast, which is on the Thames. Uh, the first thing we're going to do with it is pre-compose it, move all attributes, and rename it image, click OK, um, it's going to go effect, uh, channel, set channels, and we're just going to turn all these off, green off, blue off, and we're just going to duplicate it two, two more times, so command D on a Mac, the line, command D on a Mac, Control D on Windows, and we're just going to rename the layers R for red, G for green, D for blue. We're just going to move on to the red and turn the red to red, obviously. Green to green, and blue to blue. I think you get the idea. And we're just going to change all the transfer layer modes. To additive, and we should end up with the image that looks exactly like the original. The next thing we're going to do is on now. If we move this, we can see it's more the effect we're trying to make. Now I've done my add mine with an image. You can do it with a video or text. And I'm just going to show you how to change it. I'm just going to import another image. Let's drag that in. And you can also put text on it, I suppose. And there you go. It's exactly the same. So you just need to change it in one layer and it will change the rest because we've pre composed it. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to use separate X, Y, and Z position. We'll just drop that onto the red layer. And we're also going to make a expression control and a slider control. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is go to about 40 frames and we're going to stopwatch the X position and type wiggle open bracket 10 comma and we're going to use this pick whip and then pick wicket to the slider and then close the bracket. Okay, and then we're just going to animate the slider Control. If you press U, you get the keyframes going. Then go down a few frames. Change that to about 20. Go down. Change it to zero. And we can view it. And you see that you get a split happening. That's the basics of it, really. And you can see that if you go to a what you can it, the layer goes into it here. So we're just going to pre-compose all of them, call this final, and we're just going to increase the size just so you get rid of this. Okay, that's everything for the RG split really, you can change it to a video and you can increase the amount that the RG split moves, decrease it, you can make it with another layer. You can change it to the green layer or the blue layer to move, and you can use uh, the Y position as well. Uh, so experiment with that. Uh, let's just see what we've created. Thanks for watching this effects portal.no tutorial. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to sign up for the newsletter and comment below. We'd love to know what you think of the tutorials. We'll see you next time.